And good morning to you once again, meteorologist Vanessa Alonso here. The time now is 747. This morning we have been watching showers and thunderstorms push through the northwestern sections of Mississippi. Expect those rain and storm chances to move into our region later on today. So don't forget the umbrella as you're heading out the door. Even though it's looking beautiful right now, it's going to be a completely different picture as we head into the afternoon as we're going to be experiencing scattered to widespread chances of showers and thunderstorms this afternoon and temperatures will be warmer in the lower 90s. We have a disturbance out to our west this morning. This is what's going to be responsible for the rain chances as we head into the rest of the work week. There is Fred or the remnants of it as it pushes off to the northeast. That is no longer a concern for us. Bright sunshine, a few clouds out there in Vernon looking out to the east from Duran's Pharmacy this morning. Currently 73 degrees there, 74 outside the WCBI studios. A few clouds out in the distance, but overall not looking too bad as you're heading out the door with the bright sunshine and temperatures in the 70s. Here's the breakdown of that bus stop forecast for you parents as you're probably right now scrambling to get the kids ready for school. 79 as we kick off our work and school day. 89 by the afternoon with a few showers and thunderstorms beginning to pop up lower 90s by the afternoon. I'm going for 91 in Columbus, 92 for you Starkville, 93 in West Point, 90 degrees for Tupelo. So let's break everything down for you in your hour by hour forecast for today. Clouds will continue to build in by midday. Showers and thunderstorms will remain to our north and to our west from Little Rock into Jonesboro, Memphis and Jackson. Then all this activity will Will eventually reach our area as we head into the afternoon hours. Some of these storms could have some gusty winds and some heavy downpours. So definitely be aware of that. Heading into tonight, we could see a few more scattered showers and storms. And then by tomorrow morning, the cycle will repeat itself once again with another round of showers and storms throughout the day for your Thursday. And this is going to stick around for our Friday. So the rain and storm chances won't be done with us just yet. Rainfall amounts could range anywhere from about a quarter to half an inch of rain. But our four, far northwestern counties, you could be seeing an inch to almost two inches of rain. Let's take a look at the tropics as we are watching tropical storm grace. This has winds now at 65 miles per hour, continuing to get its act together. Could be a category one hurricane before it makes landfall in the Yucatan Peninsula tomorrow, then make a second landfall in Mexico by the weekend. 65 mile per hour winds right now with Hayri as it continues to just stay out in the Atlantic. This is looking to be a concern for the North eastern coastline, but it's looking to stay out to sea, but something we'll keep you updated on once the showers and storms are done for us. Get ready for the summer heat and the humidity to make a comeback. Thanks, Vanessa. Marvel 